Thanks for staying with us. There is a good chance that you have been told to think about your future your entire life. You may have been told to think about where you want to go to school, what you want to study, and what career you want to have. This is especially true for secondary school students. The cost of living in Nigeria is considerably lower and than it is in other parts of the world. It's 57.28% lower than the cost of living in... Yeah. Hmm. All right. We are talking cost of living in the United States. For example, this ultimately influenced the career path of choice. We have had numerous cases of people with qualifications of specific field of study working in a completely different career path. This poses the question when we think of careers of the future, especially in Nigeria, what comes to mind? High paying job motivated by the need to survive or jobs that were created out of necessity and saturation with passionate individuals. Please let's hear what you have to say. Remember, you can join the conversation. Send us an SMS or WhatsApp to 0818-038-4663. We'll take a short, oh right. So we're discussing career of the future, careers of the future. Now ladies, mm -hmm. what are your thoughts? When I saw this topic, uh, it was quite interesting for me to think about because now we see I don't know if this has happened to you, mm -hmm. but sometimes when you ask people, so what you do, and then they say something you've never heard before, and you're wondering, okay, what does this mean? Like, yeah. um, what will I use now? Mm -hmm. I'm um, uh, maybe earth mm -hmm. analyst or, you know, <laughs> something that it's not that you're a doctor or you are a nurse or you're an engineer, you know, those normal job descriptions that mm -hmm. we're used to. Mm -hmm. The times have actually changed. Mm -hmm. Right? right. So what are your thoughts when you think about career of the future? What do you think that career is going to look like in the near future? Sanzi, I want to start with you. Okay, well, <laughs> <laughs> um, in the near future, that's from 2021 onwards, at least this decade and onwards, the, one of the um, major career changes we're going to mm. see is we're going to see more people like Maury <laughs> taking the, the internet stage, space, the limelight. Yes, doing the skits, the creatives, getting us. Yeah. yeah, the creatives. I mean, robots can't um, take over that space. It has mm. to be mm -hmm. a human Humans. doing that. So if you're in that, if you're in that field, you're safe and secure. Also, we're looking at um, analysts, be it an earth analyst, mm -hmm. data analyst, business Absolutely. analyst. I mean, you can use. Um, um, robots or what is it, artificial mm. intelligence to do that but mm. it's still not the human brain mm. so that is very much in demand and there are a couple of them software engineering we're going to, we're seeing a it's lot tech. of people yes technology we're seeing a lot of people move into the tech world remember mm. NSA yeah. part of the challenges mm -hmm. was because we technology. saw a large number of Nigerian Nigerian youths move towards technology and because mm -hmm. the authorities cannot understand what is going on in this tech field they just tagged everybody Yahoo <laughs> you know <laughs> so yeah what, um, what they do not understand they mystify <laughs> yeah so <laughs> demystify it you mm -hmm. know so um yeah where this the uh, few fields that i mentioned we're definitely it's really seeing a, a new it's a new career path mm. so i mean medics mm. is always important yeah. you know so um yeah hmm. okay you see what are your thoughts <laughs> when it comes to a career i mean um it, oh yeah let me teachers say teachers too okay because my next question was going to be if mm -hmm. this is the 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 direction, the trajectory that we're going to be seeing in the mm. near future. Are jobs, are, what kind of jobs are going to be replaceable? <laughs> the jobs that are going to be replaceable, ah, that's a tough one, but it's easy to understand because we Is have... Is your job um, replaceable? Oh, no. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> let, let me start with this. The fact that we have individuals who, are, who believe that um, people cannot... Be replaced or, or are indispensable mm. no there are people who are in, indispensable oh, okay okay so we have to look at um people in the marketing space okay jobs in the marketing space already has social media has taken, has taken over, over that advertising so, advertising you know so that they have looked for <laughs> other ways to actually do that and covid the advent of covid actually brought about 
a total major shift in the mindset mm. of the corporate um, verticals. Do you see dynamism where there now? There are different dynamisms different where directions. they are trying to, exactly where they are trying to do their jobs from home and work from home. Mm -hmm. Now, some people who we are supposed to be in the office doing the job. We have AI coming in, mm -hmm. where we also have the cleaners, the the drivers, the there are different other um, you uh, have sub, um, skills. Automated cars now. Automated that can move cars in some that, would, mm -hmm. that would take you have over robots that can clean like houses. That, that can clean houses that can tend to your to your bidding without you even having to blink your eyes. Mm. So these are the types of jobs that will be taken over, but. As a teacher in the education, uh, education sector, we believe that no one whatsoever, no matter how the person believes that, oh, I'm going to have a robot uh, a teacher who can teach my children. After all, they are more intelligent, they're smarter. They're, the moment they take there over are courses, your online courses, there are yes. things that they record now. Aside, aside no. from that, but is a human being that is still speaking. Not necessarily. And there, is, and there is the part a human emotion plays in training a child. That is so where I'm going that. to. That's where I'm yeah. going to. So when you have individuals who have that empathy, they yeah. can actually reason with the child, interact with the child, understand the perspective of the child, the robot will not. And if the teacher is actually teaching the child from um, the I office, I think Issa is coming from this angle because she's a nice <laughs> because teacher. Because she's a teacher. No, a nice <laughs> teacher. No, no, no. Some teachers don't care. They just do your homework, submit, and go. Mm. You know. But you're talking because, oh, you're nice. You care about your kids. Yes. They Absolutely. don't care about yeah, empathy. Some is just so. about the job. Yeah, mm -hmm. so there's considering that fact. So, so they can be replaced. For those ones, robots no, can replace you don't them. think they can no, be replaced. No, they still can <laughs> be replaced because such teachers can still come into the classroom, understand the concept of of uh, the, the the dynamics of teaching that child certain behaviors. Mm. So it's like, I'm yeah. trying yeah. to imagine nobody like is, artificial nobody intelligence. Is, nobody is, they do. They do. So teachers I'm trying to imagine like artificial intelligence. Yeah. She just came my and ate well, my, my biology teacher cared. My English teacher cared. Well, my commerce mm. teacher didn't care, but my Yoruba teacher didn't care. Have actually changed. Yeah. Right? So they're, they're different ways that they do these things. So exactly. hold on, let me ask mm -hmm. you a question. Now imagine artificial intelligence handling your child. Like, they may not even know their name. Like, number no, they two. Will no, they will know. They will know every detail about they that child. Because number, it's number, imputed number, in their system. Number two, five, one. Not <laughs> no, no, no. no. That's, that's the movies talking. <laughs> that's the movies. But well, well, I want will. you to they step will. in they in this will. situation. I mean, you are a mm -hmm. social influencer. Mm -hmm. Let me put it that way. I'm a content so creator. You are co you're in the social space. Thank uh, you. And you're an influencer of sorts. So what would, as in, how do you see your role or your career how do you see it in the near future is mm -hmm. it something that is here to stay mm -hmm. as a creative what what are your thoughts about that yeah mm -hmm. definitely here to stay because a lot of times people need mm -hmm. talk coming from the influencer point of view now you want to always buy something you want to always go somewhere i can count the amount of times mm -hmm. that i've wanted to try a restaurant out i'm like nah and then i see this influencer say oh i went to this restaurant and it's nice so you should check it out and you say, mm. you so get, that word becomes so, bond yes mm -hmm. so you're always going to be useful because people are looking up to you to try out try out stuff mm -hmm. to do you know things mm -hmm. you know even though it might take a little longer for people to accept you because i remember when i start people oh my oh i'm a content creator eh, what do you what do, do you do, do? <laughs> <laughs> eh. so you just do video and post on instagram eh. and you that means you money. don't have a job eh. <laughs> and, is that your job eh. is that your, when you tell somebody you're a content creator mm. you often get Okay, so okay. apart from content creation, what else do you, what do? Else do, you do? But you don't tell bankers, apart from banking, what, what else, else do you do? do? I, I get it all the time in my messages. You know how when you do this Insta story, ask me anything. Apart from content creator, what do you do? You now say content creators explain it. Oh, yeah, I do this. I do so that you feel inclusive. Mm. That's the only thing I do. Mm -hmm. Thank mm. you. And it's, it's, I, it's, it's time I, consuming. It you is. spend hours it's, it's putting it together every day. your thoughts editing. and then editing mm -hmm. and shooting. You're working around the clock, literally. Mm. If I don't post on Instagram on one day, I'm getting messages. Oh, are you okay? Oh, what's going on? Oh, oh wow. and in my head, I'm like, I'm okay. I'm just, 
My life does not revolve around, around it. Creating so it's content. like basically working seven days a week. One wow. day you go off, your DM is bombarded. So right. people literally are actually have depending to on always you. see you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So wow. it's it's interesting how careers have changed. I mean, gone mm -hmm. are the days when then if you're paying football, like for the for the guys mm -hmm. that would be pay, and they'll say, What are you doing? You're supposed to be reading your books, you're supposed yeah. to be a doctor, this and that. Mm -hmm. Today now pa parents are looking for their children to go into soccer. They're motivating so them. They're telling go them into to it. Their kids Kids who a lot of what they do mm. is that those who say they're gamers. Mm. That's a new one for me because I'm yes. like oh, those yes. days when you used to play games. They'll tell you it's like taboo. Have you finished reading all your books? <laughs> Have you finished all? But now that children. Um, like teenagers, teens, are children. who are going for all kinds of tournaments, uh, international tournaments, mm. yes, for gaming. Right. Yes. In fact, they will tell you I'm a gamer, as in mm. there's some who sample games mm. and determine whether people should play or not. Mm -hmm. Another thing we should and also that is a job description. Yes. Another thing we should also look at in, in the context of you know job creation or the career for the future is about innovation, which mm. you've just happened on. Mm. And innovation comes in different dimensions, and it's all about what you love to do. And mm -hmm. you know, um, Judge Judy said something uh, a while back. She said that if you do not not, um, if you find um, something to do and you enjoy doing that thing, mm -hmm. find a way to make money out of that thing. Right. And with that, and that's so apt for me because if you do not enjoy doing it and making money from it, then that means that you have not been innovative enough, enough. to do something or cap that niche for yourself in the mm. in the space. <laughs> <And we> also, <laughs> Auntie I, Sorry. <laughs> Auntie I, I honestly don't feel like you have to make money, money off out of, of everything every that because you do. Then you don't, mm. you don't um, enjoy nothing. It now becomes old making money off of it. Mm. You, know, you cook for somebody. Mm. <gasps> you cook nice. You should really cook. What if I just want to... It's I just all want about, to, I don't want to sell about, anything. I'll tell you something. You know, it's all about your passion. Mm -hmm. Now, if you... Forgive me if I say, okay, you are broke, mm -hmm. right? And if you being broke and you say, oh, I need money for this, I need money for that. But you enjoy cooking mm. and you're making fantastic meals. You reel out beautiful meals from your, your kitchen. Why won't you try to make um, something uh, fantastic out of it? Okay, that's another and make, angle. Mm. And make... Um, uh, and earn a living out of it. Coming Why from the broken angle yeah. is a so good angle. That but is, we are looking at it from the perspective of having oh, a job. Right. In the I'll tell you Take it sure. easy. One, one hold that. It's thought, ladies' hold night. That, hold that. I know it's ladies' night, but let let the our viewers know that the phone lines are now open so you can call us if you have a comment you want to share your thoughts about our topic careers of the future what do they look like and how do we pre begin to prepare ourselves to to strap to position for the future to be relevant for the future mm -hmm. now we we were discussing and i remember an advert an ad that um jj okocha i i hear mm -hmm. every now and then jj okocha says uh uh, there's, he says that oh I, I, I'm not an actor I I don't I don't read scripts I'm mm -hmm. a I'm a, play, I'm I'm a, a soccer footballer. player I play football that's what I do I mean it's an ad he had to act um, a little script but he also had to infuse himself in that in that mm. ad to to see that this is who I am he didn't have to be an actor to mm -hmm. do what he did he just had to be Jejo Kocha the footballer right mm -hmm. so I'm just saying that careers have been redefined it's no mm -hmm. longer that rigid atmosphere where if it's not in a certain way mm -hmm. now it's metamorphosed into all sorts of things and mm -hmm. innovation like you rightly said it's in the mix a lot of creativity is there a lot of understanding the needs of the times right is That's there important. That's you very know important. a lot of strategy is there mm -hmm. so people are now deciding that and then a lot of personality is also there mm -hmm. so your personality can also attract certain things to you to you you're just endeared to do certain things because of who you are and mm. it's it comes natural with who you are i don't know if you, you... know the funny thing is it's a, that you made such a, um, a valid point right now starting mm. with people skill there are people who make money off of just understanding people just having good people skills. Psychology. Mm. Yeah, mm. psychiatry, psychology, all of that, dealing with the mind. That's a 
good career path right now. And then there is another one about there was something you said, EC, that I wanted to say before uh, uh, you had to come in, Noma, about making a living from things that you love. Mm -hmm. So I love knitting, for instance, and you tell me to go and make a living from knitting. Can you go broke? No, no it's not about <laughs> going broke. The, se the thing is, there are certain things I enjoy doing that the second it becomes a money-making venture, I get tired it of it. You know, because I remember you I know took what, up... what, Hold that thought. Oh. <laughs> Let's go on a quick break. We'll be right back. Welcome back. Our phone line is now open, so please call us on 0702 500 7749. Or you can WhatsApp us on 0818 03 84663. Right, so Sandy, you were saying something. Yeah, I was saying something about when on the break. Yes, I was saying something about um, yeah. knitting and the fact that I picked up a job at some point to just knit for someone. The girl was like, oh, this is so amazing. I'll pay you, just knit it. And after three hours, I was like, yeah, I'm done. Mm -hmm. I had to pack, pack her yarn and everything. I said, you know what? <laughs> I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I really can't. Because the well, fun was just, was just out, out, out of it of for it. me. So the thing is, you love doing something, yes, but does it solve a need? Hmm. That's another view to it. If it solves a need, because for instance, hmm. if I like jumping up and down, does jumping up and down solve a need for someone but if for some reason i find out that okay doing this entertains you or doing this does this then that's you can pursue it and make money out of it all right yeah we have mm. franca from lagos franca welcome to the show can you hear me uh, yes i can hear you all right so what are your thoughts uh, I, your discussion on uh, this future career. Yes, careers for the future. Let me tell you something, the career future, sorry. There is something that is happening now. You might have your business running in your home, mm -hmm. but people around you are all over you, envying you, trying to destroy you, trying to destroy that your business. Mm -hmm. So how can you go about it? Franca, do you have, what, what's your career now, for example, and is it, do you think that it is designed for the future? I'm a businesswoman for now. You're a businesswoman. What kind of business do you do? Okay, I sell food stuff. You sell food stuff, okay. Yes. Do you think it's sustainable for the future, or are you thinking yes. of evolving what you do? It's okay. It's okay for the future for now. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you, Franca, for your contribution. Okay. You know, another thing is, most times, sorry, you see, yeah. a lot of jobs that we look down on are going to be so relevant in the future. Like traders, in the UK, in the UK, they mm -hmm. were looking for people. They were, uh, there was some um, description about for the kind of people that were looking for hand skills for mm -hmm. taking you know Plumbers, this, more this like blue collar jobs this not the white collar jobs job, actually jobs. cleaners yeah they need a cleaner so i mean there are some jobs that we you would still need or still have relevance let me put it right. that way mm. yeah it like I, like you stated earlier it depends on the climb mm -hmm. so in nigeria for example we will, if I can do my cleaning myself, why will I need a cleaner? Right. So it depends on COVID, the client. COVID taught, taught us Taught that. us a lot of things. There is so. nanny too. Being a nanny is <laughs> another very lucrative job. If you're in going the to be overseas? an honest nanny. Yeah? In the overseas or here? Not here. Here too. Huh? No. Here, I think. Both abroad people, and here. People have agencies no. for nanny. Mm. Oh, definitely. Isn't it? Yeah, they do. Yeah. They so have, you get they paid have from agencies. But it's the agency much that's do, making is, the money. Is it lucrative for uh, the nanny? It's not the same. It's not in a business field. It's not the people at the top that are making more well, money. Well, mm. uh, let's look at another thing. <laughs> so you should aim at being at the top. <laughs> the first time um, I, I, had the, I heard the word um, aeronautic engineer oh. was from my student. Mm. Everybody in class stated, oh, I want to be a doctor, I want to be a lawyer, I want to be this, I want to be that. But not one person said aeronautic engineer. Today, the young As boy... That's space also. Yes, yes it yeah. has to do with uh, being an engineer, um, fixing planes and handling planes. That's a different engineer. That is a total different spectrum, a different field entirely. Mm. And believe me, that's another lucrative um, 
space for individuals to you know tap into and when this young boy said this word to me i had to start thinking arrow arrow oh planes okay so he was making sense today he's doing that mm -hmm. now i can tell you unless they stop flying planes or the which stop, is not going to happen which is not going to happen anytime soon will that young boy be out of a job mm. so let's also look at things like that mm. and you know worked with you know grooming individuals or children towards that space more mm. you 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 have mixed uh, yeah. thoughts no, no, about no, no, that no 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 i was i was flowing until she said would that boy not have a job is he in nigeria he's not if he's in nigeria he, he'll he, be broke he no because let, let it's no, not that necessarily broke for now because currently, some of the career choices are yet to be recognized here in nigeria it's not even about there are being in er, engineers that studied er, the, he's in not nigeria. he's not in nigeria he's okay. in the u.s right mm -hmm. now. then i'm with you yes that was the only thing that threw me up yes now. that's why i stated that for whatever reason is well i'm not talking about it um based on a climb i'm looking at it globally mm. yes okay. so it's not about this here um, it's this not part of the world africa Mm -hmm. Let's not talk about Africa. Okay, good. <laughs> well, it, mm. uh, Africa is still a developing um, continent, yeah. right? Absolutely. So until the needs arise, basically, I think some the need has some already careers, risen, or we don't do we we, we do not it, give it cognizance. Okay, so let me even ask this question: mm -hmm. Africa uh, is Africa slow to meeting up with the expectations globally? Okay, we have Peter on the line. Peter, are you with us? Yes, I'm with you. Hello. All right. Mm -hmm. Peter from Gombe. Good to have you. What are your thoughts, Thank you please? very much. My thoughts towards your discussion <laughs> is that I want to confirm if truly Nigerian situation can give somebody what he truly wants hmm. in hmm. job career. Hmm. Because let me use an example for example like jam. You, are prepared, you want to be a doctor. But when the jam result comes out, it will not even favor you. Mm. And even if the result comes out after the university system, you will not be able to get a good job. Okay. So I want to know if truly the All Nigerian right. situation favors uh, the career, career choices for the future. Yes. All right, thank you so much, Peter, for your contribution. He, if, Peter raised a very valid point. If. The, and that was where I was going to. Mm. Is Africa positioning mm. to, to, to encourage and to help its citizens? To pursue their passions? To and be, their uh, is, is Africa creating that environment to be able to allow people thrive in the different ca career paths that they're choosing as a position for the future? I would say that Africa generally, because of the society and the mindsets, puts a limiting hold mm -hmm. on you. It pegs you at a certain place. So if you're going to grow beyond that, you're going to, first of all, remove that mindset of Africa is holding me back mm -hmm. and realize that you are the one holding yourself back. Okay. So if you're not able to break that glass ceiling over your head, then you're going to keep being limited by Nigeria and then after Nigeria, Africa and then the world. So, yeah. uh, from what you're saying, it's really about the people. It's about the person. Okay. You can start from wherever you are. I mean, I don't want to go motivational, but <laughs> really, it's, it's always about you. We acknowledge the limitations. It is there. Mm. But then many have crossed that river. So, follow the path. Mm. Right? Mm. Mori, what are your thoughts? Mm. I don't know. I kind of feel somehow about it. Because if we see people grinding, like working. Working hard. Hard mm. every day. And but you Working move hard and working smart. Right. Both, both. You mm. you move you move a step, and, and the they pull you five you. steps backwards. Like it's not everybody that has the tenacity to. I don't. I don't to have keep. to suffer or struggle before mm. I. I mean that's what people are doing. So I don't mm. like that we try to make it seem like it's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, do the work. Yeah, suffer. Yeah, that's not healthy. Mm. By the time you are now ready to reap the fruits of your labor, you're yeah. weak from. All a, of the a spark that has worked, you know, mm -hmm. so you're just so hard. you're not taking care of yourself instead. So mm -hmm. I don't think that is healthy. I think that the Africa as a as a continent can do better, you know, and um, they definitely are holding people back. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's you wanted to say something. One hundred percent. We we every with day Murray. we come here. We uh, with Mori, of course. We're you know, grinding. Every okay. second we grind, and we keep coming back to something which we tell the the business. Uh, 
uh, in the business space, they keep saying something about uh, the government's policy. The mm. government's policy. Policies not are not helping being, people to... Not being easy for individuals to understand because one minute is like this and it's so volatile. You don't know what they come up with next that you know frustrates the business space. So yes, Africa and Nigeria in particular does have a limited hold on, or actually helps. Um, the individual to be limited in their thinking, in their in their dispensation, in everything that they do, and their mindset. But it takes innovation. Okay, so that's where I'll come to Sanzi's point of view. Mm -hmm. It takes innovation for you to look beyond what is being meted out on you to rise above it. Mm -hmm. Look, we all face challenges in one way or the other. Sure. But the key thing is. Whatever career path you're going to pick, whether you're a doctor, whatever you decide to do, you will face challenges in the cause of it. So now it's for you to be able to rise above that challenge you find yourself um, faced with. Fear is imminent, it's, mm. it's normal. That but you true. rising above that fear of whatever is, is in front of you is what makes you, you. Mm. So yes, the society, Maurice, Maurice the society, I mean, the society at... does hold you back. Right. Nigeria does hold you back. Africa does hold you back. Brain drain. There Brain drain. Look at what happened with the doctors. The confines I mean, of Africa to be able to go to places where some of the career mm. is being recognized. That's innovation. In their need of. That's innovation. To be able to So you to think thrive. for yourself. To be able to, to, to okay yes. to re-strategize, mm -hmm. right? But the point, even, listen, for you to even re-strategize and say, okay, I'm traveling out of the country for this period of time to do this, to educate myself, mm -hmm. to invest in this, to acquire knowledge, to mm -hmm. build this and then come back and invest. Mm -hmm. That is still part of the movement, right? So if you feel like this place is holding back your mindset, you need exposure, mm -hmm. go, out, go outside and get... But good it's easy as well to go outside. That's what I'm saying. If you can afford to go outside, go outside and study. Mm. I want to go outside and study right now. I cannot afford it. So what do I do? I take advantage of Google. I take advantage of YouTube. You, I take advantage you, of Jamie? following people who have achieved the path on mm. Instagram and all that. And I'm taking the path. So mm -hmm. eventually when I build myself to a certain level, it's only a matter of time before that door opens for so me. So it's still back to the people. Exactly. Back to the person. Mori, mm -hmm. what are your thoughts? You? Mori is not here. <laughs> I mean, uh, I get where Isi and Sanzi are, are coming, coming from. from. Sanzi, um, I took two dimensions, Isi, actually. Yes, Isi, you are talking about challenges as a doctor, you know, every profession. If I'm a yes. doctor, the only challenges I maybe want to face is the challenges that naturally comes with being a doctor. Mm. Oh, there's maybe a new cure. Do I cut the head first so that the patient doesn't die? Do I? That's the challenge. That's a big Life challenge for, is the, not in for, white for and doctors. Black, no, 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 no. Like there's the professional challenges. Okay. You know, the innovation in the workplace. Let's innovate this drug so mm -hmm. that it makes this person better. That alone is already a headache. Mm. But if the government is adding to your headache, that's where you mm. will see that somebody forgets something says somebody's ear. Because, <laughs> because the know, government when you go home is another problem. Because government no light, did not like, come up with if you're incompetent, you're incompetent. You're incompetent. So ways to support you, then you forget <laughs> Jesus in somebody's head. Like, no, 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 no. no. He was an so example. He was your angle. That's a wrong that's, He was an <laughs> example. I'm just saying, if the atmosphere was more conducive, right. people would have more time to think. There will be less and stress. I understand where you're coming stuff. from. Mm. That, and that, more productivity. Yes. So maybe that example was a belief. <laughs> yeah, that's extreme. extreme. Don't forget to just <laughs> in anybody's ears and say it's me, please. That was not what I meant. But you guys get where I'm coming yes. from. Absolutely. Yes, 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 yes. We do, we do okay. get what... I don't know if anyone has comments. So okay. while we're checking for comments, I went on to research um, some of the... Oh dear, my lashes... In my eye. Sorry. Sorry. So Pardon sorry. me, guys. Thank you. So I went on Pardon to research. Uh, challenges. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody needs to find a way to handle long lashes. <laughs> long natural lashes. Okay, so I went on to research um, some of the fun jobs, most fun jobs yes. in the world. And number one is video game um, creators. Okay. Right. And then the second is fashion consultants. Mm -hmm. Then we have radio announcers, event planners, um, race car instructors, sorry, I'm really tearing up. Uh, it's um, okay. Pet groomers, writers, novelists, food critic, voiceover artists. 
feel oh, sorry. Wow. Oh, it's my so really is bad. So oh, my okay, I, I also did my own oh, research yeah. in the digital space, and what I came up with. Uh, the data analyst, mm -hmm. the data scientist, yeah. cloud computing, cyber um, crime, cyber security, cyber yeah. security mm -hmm. and blockchain developer, mm -hmm. and digital marketing. Like I said, that yeah. digital yeah. marketing will be. Uh, then we also have software developers. Okay. These are the spaces that will be um, For me, okay. taken over I've in been, the digital I've space. Let me read this comment mm -hmm. from mm -hmm. Adi. Yeah. Ade, thank you for your comment. It says, yeah. good evening, ladies. Health sector and social housing are lucrative careers for the future. These okay. sectors need manpower, not robots, to activate the services. So it's mm -hmm. just in addition to some of the, the career paths that people m might consider for the future. Absolutely. Yes, Mori, you were saying something? No, I don't have a comment. I just okay. Want to, I just want to <laughs> chip in to say I definitely didn't get the memo because you say you research, you say you research, I'm just like, okay, you need to, <laughs> no, 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 well, need to do better, girl. Career, <laughs> oh, career shoppers. On. So I, 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 I too mm. went online just to Look around, mm. shop around, and yeah. see what are what what are the fun okay, things I would see. Somewhere, <laughs> <rub it in. laughs> but the interesting mm. thing I saw was mm. uh, career sh um, what they call it, uh, shoppers. Mm -hmm. As little as I don't know. In fact, I saw an ad the other mm. day, and it had this young man said, "Okay, that they have an app where you can just uh, point. Oh, I want this amount yes. of tomatoes. Mm. I want this. I want that, and that compute, and you it's pay delivered. it, and they deliver." So you don't have to go to the market. To the you don't have market, to yeah. go through the stress, stress of shopping. Yeah. And there are people who shop, you know, online shoppers. They just pick up your list or the things mm. that you want. Maybe fashion, clothes. Yeah. You mentioned I fashion. Personal so I said shoppers. Personal shoppers. They go pick up your clothes and then you pay for the services. Yes, so now do. more of the future career that we're seeing mm. will be per, uh, people oriented yeah right it has a human angle so those ones that are sustainable those ones that are mm. irreplaceable are most likely the ones that have human angle to them Absolutely. those ones that have um high skills mm -hmm. you know management skills emotional intelligence skills, skills, people skills. skills specialized skills social skills mm -hmm. so those ones cannot be replaced like being a teacher for example so mm -hmm. i agree with you in that Even part being yes. in the media <laughs> you know because no matter what happens you robots know, can't read the news. Robots can't have a conversation. Robots like we, can't at read least the news. they haven't created that one. <laughs> robots yes. can't like you know they have to be programmed on like mm -hmm. an individual thinking for themselves. Like I don't know what you're thinking. You don't know what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So out of the 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 specialty of my brain, I'm bringing out thoughts and telling mm -hmm. you this is what is going on yeah. in here. Robots can't do that. Mm -hmm. You know. So mm -hmm. media definitely. And with that, I will buttress the fact that, you know, communication skills is mm -hmm. also crucial. Oh, sure. Yes. It's crucial. Definitely. It can never, In fact, ever now, be. more than ever, more than ever, people are important. looking for those who have social skills. Even at yes. work, it's a high criteria. Absolutely. When you are applying for jobs, they want to know how can you manage people? How mm. can you communicate the effectively? The soft skills are crucial. Very key. Right. Maria, I think you wanted to say something. I was something. just going to add to what Sanze was saying and yeah. say that just even the entertainment industry in general. Absolutely. The so creatives. Robots can do movies, the they can do songs, mm -hmm. and that. so there's also that one. Yeah, I think those I like that will have that original ideas, I, original yeah. content, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. will also be will be seeing them in the future of career mm. well, globally because you cannot replace an original idea no exactly you can't yeah you it's can't. just like you know it, when she talked about songs i that actually resonated with me because of the fact that david o decided to you know sing his song and and going to the music space instead of actually going to school i, I think that was shared in the platform when mm -hmm. he, they they david talked about go it to school? No. no he said he he, he, he opted to do while music. he was going to school oh. he was he he opted to do that. music yeah, full business. time, mm -hmm. you know, and that actually made his um, dad come after him with the with police. The police. <laughs> so <laughs> imagine if there had been no music, what would he, what would we yeah. have had David o with today. David O? Yeah. So yeah. I think that's crucial for mm. us to also consider that music can never be replaced. Mm -mm. Right, and Very at true. athletics too. I remember oh, my yeah. brother back in the days. He was mm. so into your, basketball. Your your brother yes, is a, my, my a younger prof. brother. Yes. Okay, yeah. So he He's was so baller? into basketball, and okay. then my uncle, we were, we were with my uncle. I grew up with my uncle then. Okay. Um, he would stop him, say, "You can't go to basketball. Go to class, read your books." And then he stopped mm. for a season. 
And then after a while, he just picked it up like, okay, let's just do this and just get on with it. And eventually, that's what basketball took him to the U.S., mm -hmm. put him on scholarship through high school, um, university, and now master's. Wow. So he's not quite like sassy. Yeah, well, you have we are comments. Comments. NFL. Is, do you have a comment? <laughs> wow. Um, yes, I do. Can you imagine? Do. Laughing season. Oh, Hi. yay. Yay, yay, yay. yay. So let's read your comments very okay. quickly. It's My so comment funny how goes thus. Um, good day to all the ladies at Waze. Your program is quite educative. Mm. It's indeed an enlightenment, enlightenment program. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. It's indeed an enlightenment program. Please, I would like to specifically speak with Uti Elu. Oh my goodness. Okay. Kindly link me up with her. Thanks. Omo Epo Michael. Okay. Noted you will be. <laughs> okay. I hope it's concerning career path for the future. Yes. yes. <laughs> All right. This says, you ladies are amazing mm. and always on point in your topics. Thank mm. you. It is really informative, educative, and perfect. Yeah. Welcome to the month of greatness to all of you at Waze. God bless you. all of you. I always watch Plus TV because of your program. That's Bobby Kennedy from Jalingo, Taraba oh, State. Awesome. Thank, you. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Did you have a comment? No, because somebody at the back doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> because why, why would I have a comment? <laughs> don't don't mind them. Don't mind what them. Is such a clown. <laughs> <my goodness. laughs> so I, I think I think really as we wrap up that mm -hmm. basically mm -hmm. for career for the future it's important for yeah. people to know that to be relevant in the future, especially as career path is concerned, mm -hmm. you have to learn to reinvent yourself. Right. The times have changed, Absolutely. the seasons are different. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you have to be able to position yourself to continue to remain relevant because basically anyone whose mind is not transformed mm -hmm. back to what you were saying Sanzi will be obsolete at the end of the day. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. And then for those who need um the or some of the things that they need to pay attention to those yeah. who are seeking for career in the future because a lot of young people say oh mm. I don't have a job I don't um I don't uh, know what to do. Exactly. So some things you have to pay attention to is listen mm. to your heart. What can you do? What yeah. what do you, you naturally do? That can yeah. be a starting point. Key. Then looking out for opportunities. On mm. social media now, people mm. are advertising. There are different mm -hmm. things that when you begin to even talk about basically what you want, you find out that options will begin to show up. There's Absolutely. Google. There's Google for you to also share. And then become savvy. Being able Tech to... Tech savvy is crucial. In add-on things. I mean, yeah. you may not be a, 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 a professional... A digital person mm -hmm. but at least have an idea it was a covid season that i learned how to use the app covid, uh, I said the, app COVID. <laughs> the app canva <laughs> yes. and I, I i found out that i started doing better with my advertisement on oh. my social media posts mm -hmm. and all of that yeah. it became more professional and more and more as an ex as i explore i see that i get better with each person day so yes. do we have final thoughts as we wrap up i think for gone. you to have a career path you have to be deliberate you have mm -hmm. to be intentional mm -hmm. and you have to have a goal what do you want to achieve in this career path absolutely so it's essential Sanzi, right. thank you. so for me if you discover your talent and whatever you have to do you love doing don't just do it refine it make sure that it is marketable that way people can buy into absolutely. it absolutely right absolutely yeah. maury well i feel like in as much as i expect you to love what we do sometimes mm -hmm. if your body says take a break Take, Take a, a break. break. Please do. <laughs> and Please enjoy Maureen's updates on Instagram. Yes. <laughs> All right. So before we go, do ensure you follow us on Instagram at Show Africa. You can interact with us further, drop a comment. And most importantly, we have started our giveaway just to say thank you for watching and believing in the Waze brand and for following the conversation. So follow us on Instagram now at Show Africa. To see all the goodies up for grabs. Remember to like, share, comment, invite your friends and family to watch us and follow us as well. So if you missed today's quote, here it is again. Choose a job you love and you will never have to walk a day in your life. See you tomorrow at 8 p.m. as we bring another great conversation to your screen. Bye for now. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.